666. Richard, let's get to Yella. Saudi in a minute. You look. <laughs> One day we won't laugh at it and then we'll just stop doing it. But for yeah, now, no, I think we should we should retire. <laughs> um, number one, Saudi GP, GDP grows 9.9% in Q1, beating flash estimates. Saudi Arabia's gross, gross domestic product grew 9.9% in the first quarter, the fastest in a decade and more than a flash estimate last month of 9.6%. Official data showed on Tuesday, according to Reuters. It was the fastest expansion since the third quarter of 2011, with the increase in oil production a key factor, said Monica Malik, chief economist at Abu Dhabi Commercial Bank. Yeah, I mean, the Saudi economy is red hot right now. Uh, the General Authority for Statistics said this growth is due to the high increase in oil activities by 20.3%, which makes sense. Oil prices are up. Crude petroleum and natural ga- gas activities were the highest contributor to GDP at 32.4%. Um, but the, sort of, the study also said that all economic activities recorded positive annual growth rates in the first quarter of this year. So the economy, both the oil and non-oil economy, is just humming along right now. And Richard, this was sort of as predicted by economists that we talked about at the end of last year. Um, just the Saudi economy is in a really good spot right now. You know, the the World Bank just came out with a global report and and had have readjusted every every region across the globe down in terms of expected growth, except for the Middle East, primarily the oil producing states. And Sub-Saharan Africa, which is up by 0.1 percent, but really the Middle East, and, and specifically with the engine of the Gulf, the oil-producing Gulf states in Iraq, and um, they they are they are expanding while the rest of the, the the globe is not contracting, but their projections are are being readjusted downwards. And they're going, they're really doing well. Now, I thought this was interesting because, and, and I think it's it, it's an interesting point, and in, and in, by comparison, I, I was. It occurred to me that third quarter of 2011, this is the fastest expansion since the third quarter of 2011, was uh, Saudi's response to the Arab Spring. And in fact, that in February 2011, King Abdullah returned from a three-month stay in Morocco after he had surgery in the U.S. And so that's February 2011. Uh, the Arab Spring, you know, quote unquote, had really started that early that year, January and you saw, you know, over the course of the Arab Spring, five governments topple. You saw Libya, Yemen, uh, Tunisia, Egypt, um, and there's a fi- uh, I think there's a fifth. But um, so it was a fraught time. And the response was, as King Abdullah came back and he, he uh, unveiled $37 billion worth of benefits for Saudis. So, you know, that, that, that was unveiled in February. So that's going to come out uh, in that third quarter. So, so this is kind of what we've talked about in the past. This kind of, of input, uh, you know, jolt to an economy, $37 billion, is uh, sort of a transitory one. It's, it's not, you know, it's not infra- infrastructure or any, that sort of thing. Uh, and that's different from what we're seeing now, which is a more <clears throat> fundamental change. Obviously, there's this, you know, we're not going to have 9.9% growth every quarter. This is just a lot of this is commodity based in oil. But the point being, non oil economy, for example, rose 3.7% from the previous, uh, from this quarter. So I just thought it was interesting juxtaposing it with that third quarter of 2011, which is what they're benchmarking it against. Entirely different bounce to the economy. You know, artificial, you might say, a thirty-seven billion dollar infusion, one-time infusion. I think the Saudi, it just you know, the Saudi Saudi economy is looking really healthy and positive right now. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why tuning into the nine six six is a really good idea if you want to understand what's going on in Saudi Arabia beyond, but beyond the headlines, because that was fantastic, Mr. Wilson, <laughs> giving that context <laughs> onto twenty eleven and why there was that huge bump. Um, and that was the last time that they saw that. that. That's just that was really, really fantastic. Uh, well done, sir. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um, we do get beyond the headline here on the 966. And a quick reminder to subscribe to us wherever you get your podcasts or on YouTube. It's all Gucci. Wherever you oh, want to get us, we'll be there. 